going to be about the Ring of Honor uh, Koch DVDs, which were released uh, Tuesday. For those of you who are not aware, I talked about it on my last video, but I wanted to give it more time because there's a lot about these DVDs that needs to be talked about. Okay, first, these are not going to be easy to find, I'm going to be completely honest with you. And second, it's going to be very tempting to buy them from the Ring of Honor site. To be honest, that's not a good idea. Because if you can if you can find these at Best Buy and FYE and Hastings and whatnot, and buy them there, it's gonna it's gonna be better for those DVDs because then those stores are gonna carry them a, a lot, or actually gonna carry them. This is gonna be I would compare this to for those of you that went out and bought Fire Pro um, when it came out. Fire Pro was not easy to find because a lot of the retailers figured, eh, you know, not a lot of people are going to buy this. It doesn't look like it's going to be that popular. We'll just stick it on the website. And it sold out pretty much everywhere it went. And uh, within about, I think, three or four weeks, the stores started carrying it. Now, if you go to most uh, retailers, most retailers now have Fire Pro on the shelves. Now, that said, this is very much the same thing. Best Buy has it on their web, has both DVDs on their website. However, you can't um, get them at the store. Um, FYE apparently has them on the website and they have them in select stores. I went to Hastings, for those of you that have Hastings near you, I went to them. They're completely sold out. Um, and I don't know when they're going to get more. And Amazon still has some, apparently. And uh, FYE, um, as I said, has them and they have them cheaper than anybody else. So if you were going to buy them, that's where I would recommend going to them. Now, I didn't get a chance to really go over a lot of these, both DVDs. I will definitely say this, Bloodstained of Honor, which is definitely, I would say, I haven't seen either of these, but just from the match selection, because I've seen almost every match that is on both of these DVDs, um, Bloodstained of Honor is the better of the two, by far, and I would actually put Bloodstained of Honor um, up there with a lot of the best uh, uh, WWE DVDs that have been released as far as match quality goes, th that good. Um, particularly uh, Team ROH versus Team CZW, that was an awesome, awesome match. Um, Cole Cabana versus Homicide in the Ghetto Street Fight, that's an awesome match. Uh, the CM Punk, Jimmy Rigg Dog Collar match, that's an awesome match. Uh, Samoa Joe versus Jay Briscoe in the Steel Cage. That's an awesome match. I mean, there, there, there's, and then of course you have Kevin Steen, El Generico versus Jay and Mark Briscoe in a Boston Street Fight. That was amazing. Just, there's just a lot, a lot of amazing stuff on that DVD, and I, I would definitely say is definitely worth checking out if you've never seen Ring of Honor before. Always wanted to see what Ring of Honor was about. Uh, there you go. Fye has both DVDs for I believe if you're a member, you can get it for $8.99. If you're not, you can get it for $9.99. It's a pretty good deal. Uh, Stars of Honor, I, I would say, is probably going to be the more popular of as far as if these DVDs get popular enough where they start carrying them in the stores. I think these, this will be this, the DVD that most people will pick up simply because it features people that people have heard of, such as you have Samoa Joe and CM Punk. You have um, MVP. You have uh, Jimmy Noble. You have... Uh, Brian Kendrick, you have Matt Hardy, you have Christopher Daniels and Christian Cage, you have Loki, um, Samoa Joe, and Jay Lethal, and Homicide in a match. You have, uh, and also you have, you know, the history of Joe versus Punk, and you have a Mick Foley and CM Punk promo. So I definitely think those will probably, that will probably wind up being the more popular if they get in the stores, because I think people will be more interested in picking those up because of the people they recognize. Um, however, that DVD, while not as good as Bloodstain of Honor, is still a good DVD. There, there's no, I would say, horrible, bad matches on there. I think all the matches were at least good. Um, and there are some really, really, really good matches on there as well. So, definitely worth uh, checking out. Like I said, this will be, I said this on the Ring of Honor boards, uh, this is going to be a lot like when uh, Pro Wrestling, or that, Fire Pro came out. Just do the best, it's going to be hard to find it first because I'm sure a lot of the retailers are like, what's this? And already um, you've got a lot of people looking for it. Um, it's apparently selling very well on Amazon, so I would imagine people will probably start carrying it more on a regular basis. But, as I said, if you're going to buy this, and a lot of people want to buy it from Ring of Honor, it's actually going to be better if you buy it not from Ring of Honor, and also a lot of places have it cheaper than, if it, than what Ring of Honor is selling it for as well. So... 
definitely, if, if you get a chance, um, check out these two DVDs. Um, I am going to get them, and when I get them, I will do a review of them. Um, even though, like I said, I particularly blessed the honor. I have almost every single one of those matches, um, with the exception of, I believe, one, which is the Second City Saints versus the Prophecy. I don't think I have that one. But um, I have to check. I don't think I have that one. I think that's the only match with Bloodstain on right And there's there's honestly quite a few of the Stars of Honor matches that I don't have simply because they're on shows that I, I don't want. So um, definitely, I would say check out these DVDs again. I would say again, I'm gonna have some links. I'll have the FYE link. I think that I think that, that so far that's the cheapest I've been able to find it. Um, I'll also include the Best Buy links and the Amazon links as well. So, there you go. Um, hopefully this helps some of you that have been looking for this. So, anyways, I'm out, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.